Hi again. This is Bambi reading a story to you today called What If Everybody Did That? It's written by Ellen Javernick and illustrated by Colleen M. Madden. I chose this book today because it is Earth Day this week. And Earth is a wonderful planet that we live on. And we need to take care of it. And that's what this book is about. Hey, when we went to the zoo, I fed just a little of my popcorn to the bear. The zookeeper waved his brown broom and said, What if everybody did that? And it says right there on the sign, Please do not feed the bears. What would happen if we all did? Oh, look at how unhealthy those bears would be. I just wanted to see how fast the grocery cart would go. It went faster than I expected. When the manager stopped me, she said, What if everybody did that? Look what would happen. On the way to visit Grandma and Grandpa in Kansas, I dropped just one soda can out the window. The patrolman who pulled us over said, What if everybody did that? We never should let or should we? Throw things out the garbage, uh, garbage out our windows. We want to keep this world a better place. At Uncle William's wedding, I took just a little lick of the frosting from the fancy cake. The lady behind the table glared at my, me over her glasses and said, What if everybody did that? I told the babysitter that I took a bath just once a year as she shooed me into the bathroom, she said, what if everybody did that? Can you imagine if we didn't have baths very often? It would be, we would be stinky. Look at the family photo. Do they look very clean? During story time, I had something important to say. I just couldn't wait till the end of the story. The librarian put her finger to her lips and said, what if everybody did that? Oh, this is what the kids are saying. I gotta go potty. Why can't we read one of those other books? I've already heard this one. I can touch my toes. See? How much do you weigh? I'm so hungry. My mom said that recycling is a very good thing. If we were all talking at once, we wouldn't be able to understand and hear, would we? While we sat in the car waiting for Dad... I honked the horn. I just honked a few times, but Mr. Thompson came to his door. He shook his head and said, What if everybody did that? Ooh, that would be a lot of honking and a lot of noise, wouldn't it? At the swimming pool, I just splashed a little. The lifeguard blew his whistle and said, What if everybody did that? Would there be any more water in the pool? On the bus, I just stood up to see the fire truck. Mr. Gearshift glared at me in the rearview mirror and said, What if everybody did that? Uh-oh. We need to follow rules, don't we? Just once I didn't hang my coat on the rack at school, Miss Sanders made me pick it up and said, What if everybody did that? Oh, that would be a mess. At recess, I threw just one snowball at Sammy. Mr. Walter saw me. When he sent me to stand by the wall, he said, What if everybody did that? It would be a mess. We went out for dinner. I just shot one straw wrapper. The waitress stopped taking our orders and looked straight at me, and she said, what if everybody did that? Oh, I think that would be kind of fun. <laughs> 
After the football game, I just ran out in the field to get the quarterback's autograph. The official waved his arms and said, what if everybody did that? They wouldn't get to play the game, would they? When I came home, I gave my mom a hug. What if everybody did that? That would be a good thing, especially if they hugged their bambies. Love you.